Yo guys, OG from Detroit is back here. Applications number 352 blocks outside Perry, right? So 52 is not only street boxing, sometimes messing with your friends, sometimes whatever. Sometimes it's for real. It depends, man. You, you said an ego battle or am I fight, fighting multiple guys or I'm worried he, he gonna pull a knife or it's in prison, it's a shiv. Like he, that's, that's the beauty of the system is you have to be able to deal with things in different levels of force. Okay, so I'm here, bam, I nail him in the balls, number one, we're going slow, boom, here, down here in the groin, right? So I'm outside Perry, take my head off the center line, I'm going to hit him in the nuts. Next one, boom, same thing to his solar plex, okay? And go a little bit more. Next one, just outside Perry, jab in the face, typical, right? Next one, whoa, it's a little more serious, I got to take this tall guy out, I'm going to finger jab. I'm trying not to hit his glasses now, so I'm going to simulate it up there. But in reality, he's 6'4", I'm shy of 5'11". I might have trouble reaching him. I might have to go dirty. <laughs> Big scary guy. I might have to, especially when I'm getting older, I might have to get him in the eyes a little bit. Do a little John Jones action, on, Bruce Lee action on him. All right, so that last one was here, and I finger jab up there. Okay. Now, if I had a shiver or a knife, that's going to make up the distance as well. I slip out here. Maybe he stabbed at me. Maybe we're like a little more sideways and we're, and we're knife fighting this way. And he comes, his jab is actually a knife. So now he's doing this to my face, to my throat. And I'm going to parry out here, and I'm going to get him in the throat with my shit. It will be held like that, my thumb, or there, as you see there, is also an application. And the last one, oh, two more. And the next one, a little this one. The next one, bam, I'm going to bicep destruction. I'm going to parry this outside and hit him in the bicep with a hook. Robbie Lawler did that to me when he sparred one-handed uh, with boxing gloves on. We were both injured before. He's that Filipino. It, it works, yeah. It works, yeah. And the last one, guys, so that jab comes in. I'm here, and I throw my jab at the same time when we W4. But I power step out at this time. And now as he's retracting this, I come over with this angled kind of karate style cross. I leave my elbow inside here, good head position, knee bump, and I'm ready to take him down there. All right, so I have seven applications, at least. All right, ready? Speed. Boom! 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 All right, I forgot that goon team that time, but that's all right. Give you some little bit of live, more live energy. Okay, let's hit the other angle. We'll go slow this time. that I destroy that okay and the last one I'm here but I'm gonna power step out hit this cross go into my tight body lock here look at my head pressure on his chest and my knee is a knee monitor and you can't see it I'm doing Elvis knee with the knee I taught this to one of BJJ Penn's brothers actually he did it in a fight uh, he actually pulled that off in a fight where he slipped it boom but with the step out bang cross tight waist knee bump takedown Okay, so uh, we'll show that fast one more time. Actually, I think that's good. We're going to cut it there and go to the next one. Thank you.